So if you notice your hair or your skin tends to feel more dry after swimming at the pool, chlorine from the water is likely to blame. According to a dermatologist with Cleveland Clinic, that dryness can cause problems, other problems, including a certain type of rash. Chlorine is a great product for your pool because it helps disinfect it, right? So it keeps bacterial counts down, it keeps it looking, you know, clearer and better for when you swim in it and keeping it more sanitary. The problem is, is that it's also very drying. And so the biggest thing with your hair and your skin is that they're going to get dried out from going into the pool. That dryness can also cause irritant contact dermatitis, which is a type of rash on the skin. As for your hair, chlorine can strip it of natural oils, making it more brittle. The same goes for your nails. Your eyes can get irritated from the chlorine too. So what can you do to help with these kinds of issues? Dr. Jennifer Lucas with Cleveland Clinic suggests getting your hair and skin wet before going in the water. This way they won't absorb as much of the chemical. You could also use a protective hair mask, which is like a leave-in conditioner. Swimming caps and goggles are another option. And finally, when you're done, it's important to take a shower right away. While that chlorine's on you, you don't want it to sit and continue to cause irritation. So you want to get in, take a shower, use a gentle cleanser to, you know, get that pool water off of you. And then moisturizing is really important. So you all that oil that you've just stripped off your skin, you want to put back on. So especially with products that have ceramides in them or alpha hydroxy acids, these are good products to put back on your skin to minimize the irritation and the dryness. Excellent advice. And don't forget to apply plenty of sunscreen as well before you go swimming. Not only will that protect your skin from the sun, but it can also help keep it moisturized and then act as a barrier against the chlorine.